Now there are lots of different bulbs, combs, plants you can put under different areas. But under trees like this, where it's sometimes shady, sometimes dry, but mostly there's moisture retentive there. Fritillarias. Now these are a wonderful range of plants. They don't look very inspiring, tiny little plants. But look at that bulb. You can see which way to plant it up, tiny little thing. But that will produce a flower and they're called snake's head fritillaries. Really because they have this, this effect of being like a snake's head bell. Beautiful, or checkerboard fritillaries, they're sometimes called. Um, it comes from a Latin word for checkerboard. And they're, they're sort of purple colours, sometimes white. But just plant them at a reasonable depth, you know, five centimetres is more than ample. And they will naturalise. And I'm just clearing an area, because it's well prepared soil, this. Prepared by yours truly. Plant them about, well they're five centimetres deep, but plant them about three, four centimetres apart. And you'll have a nice clump there. I'm going to plant a few clumps around the place. But these will look beautiful, they really will. So there you go after the Latin name for checkerboard. These will naturalise, go through your lawn, they'll look beautiful, they really will. And the surprising thing is you'll forget you planted them. I'm going to plant a few more clumps and hopefully the rain will keep off and I can get myself a nice cup of tea.